Hello, Virgo. How y'all doing? I love you guys. How you feeling this morning? Happy Monday. Mental Health Check Day Monday. It is mental health. I hope you all had a very beautiful weekend. Y'all know that I work weekends, so I'm not on here on the weekends, okay? But I love you guys. Y'all doing all right? Change is coming, Virgo. Let's see what's in your energy. Oh, thank you. Y'all see? Yeah, I just, you know. I know it's uh when I'm recording this uh video it's um something in my eye y'all when I'm recording this video it's early in the morning ladies and gentlemen ma'am sir sir ma'am it's early in the morning okay and um whew, and I try my best to look a little bit look a little decent okay but do y'all not realize that with the daylight saving time, I feel like I'm a little ashy too. <clears throat> daylight saving time. There we go. Uh, daylight saving time is, um, I, I clear I don't woke up about three, four times this morning thinking that it's late and it's, it's actually, uh, I, I only been asleep an hour. Every time I wake up, I only been asleep an hour. Now, I, I'm loving it because it seems like uh, with the moving forward, when the clock go up, it's like you're late for everything because the time is just speeding up. But when you fall back, fall back in the, you know, for the fall, it's like you're getting that extra hour of sleep. So it matters for me. Some people don't like it, but it matters to me. <laughs> I love you, too. I miss you, too. I hope you had a very beautiful weekend. I love you guys. Let's see what's in your energy. I saw change as I was as I was shuffling these cards. I did see change. Don't forget to go over and check out the short videos, okay? Don't Also, don't forget to check out the playlist. I have organized, organized the playlist for um, September and October. I haven't went back as far as August and all because that's a lot, okay? So that can kind of keep you a little up to date if you miss any of the videos, okay? So let's get started. Spirit guys, talk to me. This is for my beautiful Virgos. Yes, my virgins. We're very, very innocent. Very innocent. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. <laughs> so uh, with your short video, Virgo, the card that came out was the Wheel of Fortune and the eight of cups in the reverse so somebody is going to show back up in your life okay this person has done some changes in their life they made some big changes in their life because if they had not made any big changes in their life virgo the wheel would have been upside down okay so this person is returning because they have they have really changed a lot about themselves this person wants to be with you. This person wants to be on the road with you, wants to be on this journey with you. And I feel like this person is going to represent him, himself or herself. And it's up to you to distinguish if this person, Virgo, is really who they say they are. Have they really changed? Have they really did the, did the work? Have they laid, laid down their player ways? Have they laid down their ego? Have they done a, a lot of things? Whatever happened, you're going to have to distinguish between that. That means that all the healing that you have done, Virgo, that you're going to have to tap into your own self, your inner self, and you're going to have to see uh, if this person is about that, about that life. Yeah, you're going to have to see if that person is a, about that life, okay? Because you do have the will of fortune out there. That is good luck, good fortune. That is destiny. That is fate, okay? Presenting itself again. That is fate. Maybe y'all are fated to be with each other. Maybe you are fate to be with each other. But we got to see if they're about that life. Is she about that life? Is he about that life? Okay? That's that's. That's the test for you, Virgo. That's the test. Let's see. Spirit guys, talk to me. I ask you to give me clarity, understanding. This is for my beautiful Virgos. And most of all, spirit guys, God, I need your protection, okay? I do, and I do. <clears throat> yeah, let's see if this person is about, the, about that life, okay? About the life that you live in, 
okay, about the vibration and the frequency that you're living. Uh, because the Wheel of Fortune is the fate card. If you go back on the short video, it is the Wheel of Fortune upright and it is the Eight of Cups in the reverse. This could be a Council Scorpio Pisces. That's just what that card represents or they can have it in a chart somewhere. So is this faded? Is this faded? Is this person meant to be in your life? Should you give this person another chance? Uh, is, are they, is they, how they, whatever they, about that life? About that life. Talk to me, spirit. Are they about that life? Is this person about that life? Allow. Allow. Your perspective. How you see it. Virgo, how you see it. It says, I allow abundance to flow into my life each day from limitless opportunities, circumstances, events, and people. Okay. So allowing, but looking at the perspective and gaining the clarity. Okay. The clarity, the clarity is, are they about that life? Are they speaking the truth? Okay. Is this, are, are they, is he, is she, who she, he say they are at this time. Are they really real? Do they really, you know what I'm saying? That is, uh, uh, you allow abundance. That's all you allow in your life. You have done so much healing, so much work on yourself. All I, all I will ever allow in my life is abundance. So this person has to be aligned with me and God. This person has to be aligned in what I do and what I and who I am. And this person has to be uh, in alignment of my prosperity and my abundance and my peace and joy. That's how you allow somebody in your life. That is, are they, are they about that life? Changing your perspective on how you see this person. Can you look at this person and say, yeah, I see the big change. I see a big, big change. Can you see, okay, their perspective? Can you change the perspective of, you know, of, of what you see? Take the emotions out of it. Let's think logical. Don't put any feelings in it, my beautiful Virgos. Mm -mm. Because emotions make you cry sometimes, baby. It makes you fall in love. And we don't want that. We want to stay logical. We want it to make sense to us, okay? Think, <coughs> excuse me, thinking logical, which is the king of swords in the tarot deck. Thinking logical, take, keeping emotions out of it, all right? So looking at the change, you're looking at the perspective. And it says, each day I hold a higher vibrational perspective towards all that is in my life. Is he about that life? You ask yourself, Virgo. Is she about that life? Is he or she about that life? If they are about that life, then they can come in and they can be in abundance with me because you are in alignment of what God wants you to be with me. Are you about that life? That's how I will allow you to come into my abundance, into my aura field, if you are about that life. Now, mind you, with the short video, that is the wheel of fortune. Fate. But at the same time, they done something to make that wheel turn. You understand what I'm saying? They're willing to change. They're willing to try. They're willing to do the best that they can. A trying man or a trying woman is everything. But it has to be you with your perspective on how you see this person because I can't see it for you. I'm just tapping into your energy, my beautiful Virgos, because everybody has their own different opinions of whatever relationship that you've been in. Is this faded? Is this fate? Excuse me. Is it faded? Okay. Or is this fate that God is bringing y'all back around to each other? Is it fate that God is bringing y'all back around to each other? Then you have clarity here, my beautiful Virgos. You have clarity. And it says, as I begin walking my path of self-discovery, I find clarity with each step taken and new truths are developed. Or new truths 
are discovered. So as you gain clarity about this person, if you allowing this person into your life, look at how they walk. I don't mean physically walk. Are their actions aligned with what they're saying, Virgo? And you're saying, well, some people say, well, I already know this. Why are you telling me that? A lot of people don't know that. Clarity's perspective in alignment with you. Are their actions matching up with their words? Are their words matching up with their actions? Are they talk, are they are they leading? Are they doing? Uh, are they not just talking, but are they moving? They're not just talking or are they taking steps? Are they moving in the direction, in the right direction? Are they taking action? Are they about that life? You ask. Is he or she about that life, Virgo? Now, I understand that we always hear about exes coming back or people coming back. But this could have been a missed opportunity. Remember the Wheel of Fortune in your short video. The Wheel of Fortune could be missed opportunities. The Wheel of Fortune could have been someone. Doesn't necessarily mean that it was an ex. This could have been someone that y'all met at the wrong timing. And this person has never got you off of his mind. Never got you off his mind. Now, you may have went on about your life, but this person never got you off, this, off of his or her mind. This could have been an opportunity that you both met each other, but it was wrong timing. They were going through something. You were going through something. Your focus wasn't what it was supposed to be. This is somebody that could have you have met and it did not. It just did not. You know, it didn't take off. Remember, the wheel of fortune is missed opportunities, things that are being represented again in your life. And it's up to you if you want this person or not. But mind you, you want to always see, is this person really about that life? Is he or she really, Virgo, about that life? Clarity, perspective, and allow. Those are the questions. That is what you want to look for in this man or in this woman. Because it's life. We meet people every day. We may talk to somebody on the phone. I feel like we'll find out how deep it was. But you could have met this person and uh, y'all had good conversation. And it probably didn't, even, the conversation didn't last but a week or two weeks. And it faded and went, y'all went directions. Fate will bring you back around to each other if it's meant to be. What was that we, I, I, we used to write on the walls? I know it wasn't right. In the bathroom walls at school. If you love something, set it free. If it comes back to you, then it was yours. If it doesn't, it never was. And sometimes people come back to us just to see if they can get back. But in this situation, this could be fate bringing y'all back around to each other, one another. But is he or she about that life? Are they about that life? Okay. Is their word, are their words aligned with their actions? That's, that's just what you want to see. Are they about, look, I just picked up the deck, the bottom of the deck. Are they about that life that you seek? That you seek is is or was that a missed opportunity that maybe both of you were in a headspace of coming out of relationships, getting over a death, a family death. Something was very distractive that you did not see one another. Well, of fortune, I keep saying, is it fate? Is it destiny? Destined for you two to be together. Are they about that life? Action speaks louder than words. Looking at their perspective, gaining clarity, allow them, only allowing high vibrational people into your life. This person has a lot to offer you. You may be being, you may be asked out on a date real soon, Virgo, from somebody, okay? This could be another earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Doesn't necessarily mean that, but that's just what this card represents. This person has a lot to offer you. It's something that's being represented. It's fate. 
destiny, destined. Okay? If this is not a person, this could be a job. This could be having something to do with your career that has represented itself that at, in the past you missed the opportunity because you just wasn't ready for it. I feel like that, that the universe, God, it, it just wasn't your timing for you to get that promotion or get that raise or, or get that, 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 that certain level of what you, what you wanted at that time. Okay. And now that on your short video, the will of first fortune, that you're going to get an opportunity the second time around. It's always better than the first time. You may be being presented with this a second time. See, we can miss opportunities and not realizing that where our mind, where our frame of thought or where our frame of mind is at, at that particular time, whether it was two years ago, whether it was five years ago, whether it was 10 years ago, and it's represented itself because God said you would not, you wouldn't have been able to hold it if I would have gave it to you when you wanted it. And you, or this could have been a time where you missed it because you was not ready for it. And now it's about to represent itself as you're about to be presented with this raise, career raise, career change, career whatever, or this person is coming into your life. This is big offer. This is promotion. This is leveling up. This is all, this is money gain. Okay. Access gain, uh, uh, coming towards your life. Okay. Yeah, that part right there. Spirit guys, let's find out. Is this person about that life? Okay? Also, are you ready for this life change, Virgo? Are you ready for this life change? Are you in the headspace of of getting this the, getting this promotion or this raise that's coming towards you. I feel like God said you are ready for it now, but are you psychologically are you really ready for this change? Whether this is a person coming to you or this is a career. Whatever it is, it's offering big time, baby. Okay? Fate destined. Spirit guys, tell me more for Virgo. Changing your perspective on how you see it. Whether this is a somebody that you met some years ago, whether this is someone that, uh, or whether this is a job that you want, that you put in for, uh, maybe uh, two keep coming, spirit keeps showing me two years, that you may have put in for a position two years ago, uh, 10 years ago, and you didn't get it, and it's going to represent itself again, okay? Is this someone are they about that life? Is he or she about that life? Talk to me, spirit. Clarity. Who are they about that life? Baby, I don't know who you are. Oh my goodness, I just got the spirit. The Holy Spirit is on me, baby. Woo! Look at the card that came out. They about that life. They, are, they have gained clarity, the truth, and they realize that you are their stability. They gained the truth, the light, clarity, that you are it. In fact, you are it. You are the one that they want to settle down with. Now, they, if this is a job, clarity, that this, this raise is going to set you up for stability stability baby this is gonna put you in power this is gonna put you in the king of pentacles clarity truth however this go if you want to know whoever this is that's about to show back up in your life about to represent itself are y'all fate are y'all destined to be together they are about that life i know i know but whoever this is that's about to show up in your life, Virgo, he or she is about that life. I promise you, they have gained clarity, truth from God, from spirit. See that? See the spirit holding this, this sword here? They have gained clarity, truth that God has spoken to whoever this is to tell them that you are, in fact, that person. Yeah, this person is about that life. 
if this is a job, it's about that life, baby. It's going to put you in this energy. The truth, they discover that you are the light. You are the light. You light up my life. You bring me home to carry on. Let me tell you something. They about that life. They're going to clarity twice in your reading. Two total different decks, baby. Two total different decks. Clarity. The truth. That they know that you are, that y'all are destined to be together. And they're not going to stop until they get you. They got a lot to offer you. See this King of Pentacles? This person is financial stable. This person is stable. Okay? They about that life, Virgo. They about that life. So if you was questioning, if somebody has resurfaced into your life lately, if not, they're about to real soon. They're about to resurface into your life very, very soon. And you questioning, are they about that life? They are. This raise, this promotion, this change of career that's been getting ready to be represented to you because you missed it in the past or you was not qualified in the past, it's about to be that life. You're about to believe you're about to be living that life. You're about to be making that money. You had it that part. It's finally about to happen for you, Virgo. I don't know who you are. Sweetheart, sir, I don't know who you are. But it's finally about to happen for you. It's finally about to show up in your life and happen for you, Virgo. You're about to live that life. You're about to be that life. You're about to have exactly what you have been deserving of for a lot of years. You are now, things are now about to be represented in your life that you may have missed opportunities because you were not at a vibration, at a frequency that you should have been, that you're in now, that you did not, you were not in then, but now you about that life. And spirit guys, God is about to show up and show out in your life. God said you're ready to live this different life. And I told y'all in the last video I did for you, Virgo. Pass me the great poupon. God said you are about to live a different life. Now, I don't know who you are, but I'm going to tell you something. Spirit guys, God said I need you to keep speaking that into your energy. Because you're about to be that life. Not only are you this person, you want to know if this person living is about that life. You are about to be that life. You're about to be that life, Virgo. You're about to live a different life. And I said that. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming. You're about to, you're about to live that life. And look, you got look at here. You got the knight of the knight of pinnacles in the reverse. And the upright is slow moving. It came out in the reverse. Finally. Finally. You're getting what you deserve. Finally, fate destined the will of fortune is returning things are returning back to you tenfold <clears throat> things are re returning back to you tenfold what you lost 10 years ago is coming back tenfold what you lost eight years ago is coming back tenfold what you lost in the past and you have healed and you have gained so much perspective and clarity on your life is that you allow an abundance to flow through you in you around you you're about to be in that life you're finally about to be in that life. Everything that they stole from you. I saw the seven of swords. Everything that they stole from you. People stole your man. Stole your husband. Stole, stole your money. Stole your whatever. It's coming back to you tenfold. People that lied, stole, cheated, steal, everything. It's coming back to you tenfold. And then some. And then some. 
you are about to be about that life. This person that's coming into your life, Virgo, is about that life. They're about that life. They mean business. Somebody coming back into your life that is about that life. That at the time that you met him or her, y'all was not meant to be together. But y'all are fate. Fate, you're fated to be together, you're destined, and it's going to represent itself because this time God see that both of y'all had to separate from each other in order to find each other. You both met each other when you both needed a lot of healing and work to do, but God is about to bring you both back together where you're going to be able to see one another. And you're like, what in the world are you talking about? For some of you, you will find out soon that things are being rep represented back to you. What you lost, you're about to get it back. You ain't been in a relationship in years. And God, you gonna, let me tell you something. It's going to be worth the wait. Because the person that's coming in is about that life. You have not been, you have not gotten that position or hadn't got, gotten where you wanted to be because somebody stole, lied, deceived to keep you from getting a job, keeping you from getting a position, keeping you from moving forward. That is now over. God said you're about to live that life. You're about to live a most stable life you have ever lived before. You are about to have that stable job, that very job that you want, that very job, that very career, that very thing that they stole from you. You're about to get it back and then some. I need you to claim this for you. I need y'all to blow that comment up. I need you to raise the roof in that comment and claim it for yourself because I'm already, mine's already there. I'm already claiming it in the atmosphere because we are sometimes, we meet somebody in our life and it just was not the right timing, but the right person. Judgment is here. Judgment. Here it come. Here it come. Virgo, the truth. Oh my God. <laughs> Look at here. Oh my goodness. Look at here. Would you look? Oh, and, and listen, I ain't never screamed like this. Never. This, this whole, this whole, this whole. Look here. Judgment. It's Russian. Message, you getting ready to receive some news. Somebody rushing very quick towards you, Virgo. This could be within the next couple of days to eight days, okay? For some of you, this could be a job. Look at here. Virgo, there you go. That showed up in your energy. You have been in Herman mode for years. Look at here. The moon card in the reverse. And look at here. Change is about to happen. I can't make this up. I don't know who you are, but spirit, God is God, divine universe, God, I ask you, this is meant for me, show it up in my life, God, show it up in my life, I'm claiming this for me, you got to do it for yourself, I'm claiming this for me, not only was the knight of wands, you got the moon card in the reverse, and the Virgo card, this reading was meant for you, whoever you are, along with this could be a job that you have worked so hard, to the bones, to the bare bones and the blood, sweat, and tears at a job. And it's about to it's about to pay off. You're about to get a position. They've been getting ready to offer you a position to do something. For a judgment call is here, baby. And it's rushing in. You're about to get a level, letter, level, letter, okay, of approval. There's a message. There's somebody calling you. There's somebody coming into your energy. It's destined for you. You understand me? Virgo, I don't know who you are today, tomorrow, whenever you come across this reading. But you question, is this person about that life? Or you question yourself asking, are you about that life? And God, Spirit, God, God, who I in heaven, I'll be thy name. That kingdom come, that will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us, forgive our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thou art with us, thou rod, thou staff, thou comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of of my enemies. Until next time, Virgo.